In this problem, we have the function x to the third power plus x to the second power, and we want to determine the relative max and minimums on this graph. So if we overlay the slope at the graph at a few different points, what do we notice? The slope is at a zero at the maximum and minimum points. Now if only there were a way that we could get the slope of the line of the equation for this graph. Oh, that's right, we can use the derivative of the function, which will be the slope at any given point on the graph. Using the derivative power rule, which basically is multiplying times the power, then reducing the power by one, we get a derivative or slope of the line equation of 3x to the second power plus 2x. As stated, if we have a zero slope, the line will be flat and designated as a relative high or low. So if we factor out an x, it makes it more apparent where we will have a zero value. So if the x that everything is being multiplied times is zero, then the equation will equal zero. So at x equals zero, there is no slope of the line. Now if we get a zero inside the parentheses, we will get a zero for the equation value. If we plug in an x of negative two thirds, we get a zero value inside the parentheses, then this gets multiplied out and is a zero. If I were doing this problem, I would either use a graphing calculator or Google the graph of the equation function, and this typically has some way to view the highs and lows on the graphs and what value the x value is at. To figure out this by hand, if the point is a relative high or low, you can plug in a number that is slightly lower than the number where the slope is zero. If the slope when plugged back into the equation is positive, then it is a relative high. And if the slope is negative, then that point is a relative low. Poll update. That concludes this video. Hope I've earned a like, share, or subscription. It really helps out the channel if you do. If you enjoyed this video, you may enjoy one of these videos as well. Let me know how I'm doing in the comments down below. Thank you for watching.